Are you guys ready to paint on metal? Little buddy, you're about to get a little makeover. This is gonna be a fun time. Jokes aside, I'm on my third cup of coffee today. Let's just preface this by saying I usually only have like one to one and a half cups, but I've had all of this plus some tea. So like, we are caffeinated. We are ready to do some art. The creative energy is flowing and I'm in a good mood. So let's do it. Our faithful Posca pens will be at our side. And we have all sorts of fun things to paint, like this piece of metal. It's not super reflective. It's like prepped and ready for us. So that's cool. Hang it up on the wall. I'm really excited about this one. We also have this one. So with that being said, let's dive in because I listened to your comments. That means one of you guys is gonna have your art suggestion featured in this video, so. That's really cool. And as I said, the creative energy is really flowing in this room tonight. So we are going to do a lot of art projects. All right, with that being said, let's make some art. I think we're gonna paint a cat. Remember when I used to do my animals in clothes series? It's gonna be kind of like that one. Should I do a mint colored background or a mint colored outfit? That's a toughie. I think a pink background, right? While we are making art on metal, let's talk about today's sponsor, which is Audible. Thank you so much, Audible, for sponsoring today's video. Audible is a leading provider of audiobooks ranging from entertainment to self-improvement to fitness to news articles. There's literally thousands of things to choose from on there. So how it works, every month members get one credit for any title on the platform. And then you also get two credits for a monthly selection of Audible originals. I'm actually like a huge sci-fi post-apocalyptic junkie. So all those audiobooks are like really up my alley. <laughs> right now I'm listening to Skyward by Brandon Sanderson. I actually got this recommendation from my family and it's been an amazing audiobook. I'm really enjoying it. Yesterday, I listened to over five hours, and I only intended to maybe listen to 20 minutes, but I couldn't stop. It was really good. My favorite thing about Audible is it syncs across devices. So when I'm working, I always have my computer like right here, and I'm listening to audiobooks. But say I have to go somewhere later, boom, right on my phone, listening in my car. It's amazing. Since we're still fresh into 2020, Audible wants to help you achieve your goals and invest in yourself. So there are tons of titles to choose from on that, ranging from fitness, self-development, the list goes on. And guess what guys, if you want your first month of Audible for free, go to audible.com slash Mira or text Mira to 500-500. Once again, that is audible.com slash Mira or text Mira to 500-500. So excited about this. Oh my goodness, this is so fun. It's so easy to blend on metal. It's like wild. This makes me feel like the world is an oyster and the oyster is ours. look really creepy right now. <laughs> we'll get to them later. So I want to do a bow tie for sure and maybe uh, oh I don't know some sort of striped sweater. Man, yeah, yeah man, maybe me. Yeah. Let's see. Okay. 
I think it's time to paint the eyes. I don't think I actually want to do a bow tie. I kind of think I want to do like a really fuzzy sweater because I'm digging this giant collar. I'm afraid this marker is going to explode <laughs> because I pressed it down three times. Nothing has come out, but sometimes that means something really bad is coming. <laughs> I have a foreboding feeling. I'm like scared now. <laughs> Sit you over here. Okay, this background is looking like a mess. We got to get that under control. background reminds me of a PowerPoint gradient. <laughs> I'm digging it. Ooh, look at those eyes! Oh, he needs some little whiskers, doesn't he? The cat is done, little baby. I love the eyes. Better sand this bad boy. Ew, I hate this. I hate this so much. <laughs> I hate this. The first one didn't need sanded because it was like treated and ready to paint. This is just disgusting. We'll start with our lid. One of you guys suggested that I customize something with avocados. I do read your comments. I try to heart most of them. I try to reply to as many as I can. And I just love seeing what you guys say. We're doing a bright pink background, okay? Well, <laughs> we have this part. I have like metal sand everywhere. Yo, coloring the edges of this may have been a bad idea. <laughs> My hands smell like metal and they feel like I just need to wash them because I sanded that. <laughs> Let's outline these. Did you guys know that avocados are one of my favorite foods? I know I'm a stereotypical millennial, but I'm embracing it. All right, here's the game of the day. If you guys can guess my other favorite food aside from avocados, I will give you a gold star in the comments. They are all gonna have pits. I did some sprucing up off camera because the top layer just needed some help. So my technique is more like stippling on this. Guys, I have a lot of coffee in my system. Apologies for the weird video. I think a little bit of purple shading might help too. It's kind of fun doing all these funky colors. are the details so far. I'm really digging this. It's fun to just like add hints of other colors in. some sort of highlighting on the actual seed of the avocado. Got the box and 
here is the lid. Oh my word. <laughs> my heart is melting right now. So this one was recommended from a subscriber. Thank you for recommending this. <laughs> I love it. This one is so ridiculously reflective that it's like, whoa. I think we're only gonna do the lid on this one because it's really hard to sand the edges of this um, with these like grooves. It didn't work out super well for the last box. And it's not that fun to do the sides anyway. Like I don't enjoy it. I think the lid is enough for me. If I change my mind later, then yeah, whatever. We're gonna just. I know I've done this in the past, but it's really fun, so hey. I'm trying to do an Aurora, okay? It's just not quite working out right now. Man, I always do this. Let's experience the power of layering, because we need help right now. <laughs> now, how are we gonna do that? Stippling. They're gonna be enormous stars. Yo, this is a lot of stars. <laughs> We're having fun, right? I honestly thought I destroyed this when I started trying to blend things, but now I'm pretty happy with it. All right, I gotta say, this was so fun. I did not think that painting on metal would be as fun as painting on wood. Oh yeah, by the way, I painted on wood with Posca pens, and that's what inspired this video. So I will link the wood one down below. But let's do a recap, okay? You got this cute little kitty. Would you hang this on your wall? Let me know in the comments. Here's our cute little avocado box. And then we have the quickest one. All right, these were all our painting on metal projects. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you have any other video suggestions, feel welcome to drop them down below because I do read your comments. I read this from one of you. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new, feel free to subscribe and join the art family. And let me know if you joined the art family because I like to welcome you with a little message. Anyway, I love you guys. Bye.